Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 7 of season 2 of Pop Team Epics. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Uh oh, oh, okay, occupied. Unoccupied. What are we doing? <laughs> You know me funny if um in today's episode we get homegirl from um not well not only the person who portrayed her in Galandino um but also like Kayete herself from Galandino and Dino too I would love that I I mean we're on we're halfway through done with the show and so I want that so freaking bad but I don't think we're gonna get that but I want it you know like damn. <laughs> shake <laughs> is this week just gonna be straight up live action raising hell the hell shake arrow oh oh my god <laughs> Damn, this art is good. Doste. Oh, okay. Was that supposed to be the eye catch? No subject prints. <laughs> okay.
Oh no. <laughs> I, I know that's a little too dangerous. <laughs> Not the pick. Hmm? I'm not the angel. You put I mean, is he gonna make it back in time? <laughs> With ten seconds, Damn, that was the whole episode. That is crazy. Was not expecting that to be the whole, especially when I got to like the eight minute mark. Like, bro. <laughs> that 
<laughs> they was like, yeah, you remember at Hell's Week? We're going to give him, like, a whole episode. <laughs> Uh, but then, okay, it makes you wonder, how are they going to do the second? But, <laughs> it's a light dinner. It was interesting. Different, especially for a whole episode, because I, I personally cannot remember if, like, the previous Hell Shake video for season one was the whole entire episode. I would literally have to go back and look. <laughs> Oh my god. He went back in the bathroom. I mean, it started in the bathroom. It had to take at least, well, I'm thinking more of, like, American shows. Usually it takes, like, a whole year. So, who knows? And then it's going to close. And then it's going to open right back up. <laughs> yep. Because <laughs> it's the rerun. Um, but, yeah, I think with American shows, especially when it comes to um, freaking uh, Family Guy. When it comes to animated shows. I can't say the same for like live action TV shows. So if we're talking about Family Guy, uh, American Dad, Cleveland Show when that was on, South Park, any kids animated cartoon. It takes like a whole year just to do one season. And I know it, it's different. Like there's a lot of things that go into it from what I have done with a little bit of my research and such. Um... But from like that's like the same thing with video games. We always know that the um the voice acting, um, having English voice actors or even say use come in, that's usually always the last thing that they do before they're like hella golden. <laughs> um so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I wonder what's going to be different about this. Oh, so now we're literally having someone just announce everything instead of, like, do <laughs> we're having official series with these two. Either way, it's cute. Can't with his tooth, <laughs> really. Can we talk about how this one dude with the glasses looks like freaking um? Oh my god, what is it? Uh, um, freaking Roger from Doug. <laughs> that are uh kind of like a mixture of Roger and Judy from Doug. <laughs> uh. And now a word from our sponsors.
is it also me like we're kind of going a little bit faster with this because i mean oh we because uh, we're 16 minutes in and we're almost done with this <laughs> I wonder what a lot of people thought about this episode today. I don't remember how to play. Oh my god. Poor <laughs> baby, oh my god. Really guys, I am truly a failure today. Today, oh my god. The bird of luck. <laughs> you will find the pick of your destiny. <laughs> the fact that he did all of this within 30 seconds. No, no, like it took him 10 seconds. No, yeah, yeah almost close. And then he. <laughs> ran his behind with 20 seconds remaining breath.
with 10 seconds remaining. <laughs> I really don't know what to say about this episode. Yeah, uh, okay. <laughs> Just like the first time when I saw Hellshake, I was completely like random, be like, wow, that really happened, huh? <laughs> but it's so funny, I can't. But I, I like the fact that this was the last thing that I watched. I mean. <laughs> If I had to watch this first, I'd probably been like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but it was good. I mean, it makes you wonder, like, who did play Hellshake in the first and second half? Because really, mainly, it was these two who played them in the first half. So in the second half, we officially got actual voice actors. And it makes you do, does wonder, I cannot speak, who played who? But of course, you know. Ain't gonna know until like the week after this aired. But yeah, it was a good episode. I'm, I'm, I'm glad my girls, you know, made an appearance. Yeah, they, they literally treated you like a plaything today. <laughs> So you're telling me one person did all of that for today. Honestly, you have to applaud them. Seriously. I, I cannot imagine, like, being in that role, especially when you are, like, when it is a one-man show or a one-woman show and you're playing, like, several characters at once. Like, I cannot, like, have the absolute talent for that, especially when you're watching plays where people do that because you're so focused on, like, them playing one character that you have to get ready for them to play another character and then like how do they do that um like at once like if you're having one conversation then you gotta flip and you gotta do the other response and stuff but once again that just you know tells you the many possibility things that we can do with just our voices and such and that there's always talent in something this episode i feel like is now officially the wackiest but you know for hell shake yes of course I, I think i even said it when i watched season one the first time and such i was like okay that was just different but i liked it and, and the same thing different liked it even more loved both sides of it I, it just makes me wonder like hmm, what the heck is next week gonna be about but like i said was not expecting the live action today I, I loved it though I thought it was very interesting because when I when I loaded up the video and I and I saw this this and like this part where we're looking at right now where the video stopped at I saw this at the beginning and I was like what the heck are we going with today I was like are we doing live action or are we completely doing something different and I wasn't like I'm happy with the live action love it, it it's pop team FX thing um they done it in season one, so of course it was going to happen in season two. So now it's just making me wonder, like, we had Aoi Yuki pop up. No, psh, wrong person. Wrong Aoi. Shota Aoi pop up at the end of season one going into season two. And so it just makes me wonder, like, oh, hey, since we are getting very, very close to the end of this show, um, like, I, I want Nana Mizuki to pop up in this. She was in the freaking, like, PV for season two, like, several weeks, um before season two started airing and such and the live streams that they did like for this show so i'm over here like yeah, yeah, yeah. hello let her be in this show let her pop up 
please. There's so many other sayings that I would like to say. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 7 of season 2 of Pop Team Epic. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for episode 8. Bye, guys.